there, and welcome to the exciting world of HIP. Good morning. I'm Andrea Jackson with your wake-up call for Thursday, April 7th, 2011. A refugee boat en route to Italy from Libya capsized south of Sicily. Up to 250 are missing. President Obama's counterpart in Tripoli, Muammar Gaddafi, has sent a letter to our leader asking him to stop the airstrikes. Meanwhile, here at home, the Prez is trying to avert a government shutdown if budget talks are not resolved. Look out, Netflix. Dish Networks has just purchased Blockbuster in a $320 million bankruptcy auction. The 75th Masters tees off today in Augusta. Women's ski jumping finally cleared for the 2014 Olympics. Motorola's Zoom and tablet turning out to be more of a bust than a boom. Apple stores have been the target of a string of burglaries. Note to thieves, all Apple products are coded to destruct if stolen, meaning they can be located, locked, and rendered unusable. Louisiana has been voted the least peaceful state, Maine the most. Glenn Beck is leaving Fox. Meredith Vieira is planning her Today Show exit this year. And Entertainment Tonight is reporting Matt Lauer will not renew his Today Show contract when it expires in 2012. And Curry is up to replace Meredith if she leaves. And the Hangover 2 trailer has been pulled for movie theaters because of a monkey's naughty gesture. Apparently that slipped past the MPAA. Here is your national weather forecast. Rain from the Great Lakes to the Atlantic coast. Cool and dry across the south. Temps in the 40s and 50s from the plains to the Ohio Valley. And snow, thunderstorms, and wind from central California to the high plains. Janet, that is your Thursday morning wake-up call. I'm Andrea Jackson. I'll ring you in the morning. Be good.